people keep talking about T.O. and his cocaine rants. T.O. is a figment of y'all imagination. This kid does not exist in no other realm but in y'all head. One of the best things you could do for him and Ryan Garcia is not even talk about these guys. They ain't telling you nothing. They ain't showing you nothing. And they ain't said nothing to you that you ain't know, heard, seen, and the boxing world has demonstrated to you already. That's a fact. So what are you shocked by anything that he says or even Ryan says? Because nobody's trying to touch these guys. The only guys that's giving these two clowns the light of day is y'all talking about them. You know what I'm saying? And even me to a certain degree, because I even got to talk about it. But I got to talk about it to tell you why you don't need to be talking about it. Because at the end of the day, you're going to have to look at it like this. Who gives T.O. the platforms to say all the disrespectful shit that he has said thus far? Huh? Have you looked at the host that's done it? This is why. Nobody else is giving him the platform to say this disrespectful shit. But some ninjas. You know, and now you see how how bad y'all been how bad y'all been touching ankles out there you see it now when he says this stuff look whose platform he's on you see what i'm talking about that's why i say he's a figment of y'all imagination because he only exists inside this realm and y'all letting him feed off you like a parasite because he got nothing else going on Black folks gave him the platform to go out there and say that disrespectful shit to black folks. So how stupid does that look? Exactly what I'm talking about, man. This is the only way that he exists. Ain't nobody else getting him on there, you know what I'm saying, asking him to do that. They don't want to be associated with that. At all. The best thing you could do is not even talk about these dudes because they ain't got nothing going on. You know what I'm saying? They shouldn't get no fights. They shouldn't get nothing. They should get completely froze out. And, and what I don't get is how y'all keep condoning these guys making money. I wasn't down with no Devin Haney versus uh, Ryan Garcia, too. No, I don't want him to make shit. Even Terrence Crawford talking about fight Teofimo Lopez. I, if that's the case, go ahead and uh, fight Jerron Boos Ennis if he ever will accept it. But go ahead and go that route. Uh-uh. They, they don't need nothing from over here. You know what I'm saying? You can see they hurt. They only surviving off the black vibe. That's the only place that it matter. It don't matter to nobody else because everybody else trying to ignore this shit. I understand he keeps saying some disrespectful shit, but he be on black people platform when he do this shit. That's what don't make no sense. That's what make it worth not even fucking talking about it at the end of the day. Because everything he is, you guys are making him because there's nothing left of him. That anybody cares about. Not Bob Aram, not the boxing world. You see, don't nobody care about his fights. He, he in a bad position. This is the only way he exists. Don't you get it? He can't get no interviews unless he's down and talking about somebody. Don't nobody want to hear nothing he got to say. Don't nobody care what nothing that he got going on. Nobody asking him who he fight next. Nobody know that. Everybody know he don't want no Crawford fight or whatever and whatnot. You know what I'm saying? So... Just leave him where he's at. That's how you kill him. He already dead. Him and Ryan, they dead. They mad as fuck. Because everything they need got to come through y'all. It's got to come through y'all. They need a tank. They need a, they need it without talking about them, without being rival to them. Who and what the fuck are they? Do you even care about them? No. Not at all. Well, T.O. is done with, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It ain't nothing else to say about the guy. He's done with. The only the only thing that's still giving him life is y'all let him go ahead and do it. But I understand you uncomfortable about how much you see these dudes cooning out here. I know you're uncomfortable about it, but I tried to have that conversation with y'all. So it wouldn't be a shocker. But y'all sitting over there in shock. Y'all uncomfortable as fuck, and I'm comfortable as shit. I've always been here. That's what y'all don't understand. I've always been here. Y'all y'all don't want to have this conversation. Ryan Garcia made y'all have this conversation. Don't forget this. Hold on for a second. Oh. Yeah, I mean, fuck it. Shit. But, uh, yeah, y'all don't want to have that conversation, man.
So, therefore, this is where we at right now. And that's why y'all feel what y'all feel. But these cats don't exist unless y'all talk about them. And they ain't even worth talking about. You know what I'm saying? If you haven't noticed, we got the spotlight. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Why, why would you share to even try to give him any of it? We got the spotlight right now. It's evident. It's clear. You know what I'm saying? Whether hated or love, it still moves the needle. That's what he understands. So that's why he went ahead and lined himself with the bigots and stuff like that. Because that's all boxing is made of. That's what? Boxing is a sport of beating a black dude. It's just that simple. I'm going to go ahead and eat. I'll talk to y'all later. Who's laying them out?